as it's... Ah, oh, I've been through that bridge already once. I wish the equipment... I wish uh, stuff didn't keep... Um, showing up as... Interact with this item when you'd already done it. This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? Uh, I've come on behalf of the Jedi Council. I wish to speak to Alan Matari. You have come from the Jedi Council. Master Matali wishes to speak with you. I will inform him that you are here. Remain at this location until he arrives. <laughs> oh, that's low gain. <laughs> My protocol droid tells me you are here on behalf of the Council. I was beginning to think my demands had been ignored. Though I think your time would be better spent interrogating the Sandrils as to the whereabouts of my son, Shen. Uh, are you certain the Sandrils are to blame? Many years ago, I brought my family here to Dantooine to escape the crush of humanity on the Core Worlds. Soon after we settled here, the Sandrils arrived. And they have been a plague upon my house ever since. Somehow I imagine the story from the Sandrils would sound just about the same. Don't you? The injustices the Sandrils have committed against the Matales are far too numerous to name. But the Council is well aware of our many disputes. Recently I discovered several Sandril droids trespassing on my land. Uh, what were they doing here? I have no idea what nefarious purpose lay behind their arrival. My own assassination, perhaps? Destruction of my property? Maybe a simple spy mission? I wasn't about to find out. My own security droids destroyed the invaders. Not a single one survived. It was shortly after this incident that Shen, my only son and heir to the Metali estate, vanished. Obviously, Nurik, the unscrupulous head of the Sandral clan, has abducted my son in retaliation for the destruction of his droids. You are jumping to conclusions. Why does the Council insist on stalling? The life of my son is at stake. Is it possible... Yes, of course. Now I understand. I am a man of the world, Jedi. I know how things are done. I will make a contribution of a thousand credits to the Council in exchange for rescuing Shen from the Sandrils. I will present the credits directly to you, of course. Whether the Council ever learns of this donation is completely up to you. Huh. The Council cannot be... The Jedi ca cannot be bought. I will remain neutral despite your attempted bribe. Nevertheless, my offer still stands. A thousand credits for Shen's safe return. Know, however, that I will not sit idly by much longer. Eventually, I will take whatever action is necessary to rescue my son, including raising the entire Sandral estate. You would be willing to risk open war over this? It is the Sandrals who have started this, not I. And here I thought you would blame us if we failed. It seems everyone is responsible for your actions, except for you. I don't need to stand here and listen to such impertinence. I'm impressed, Carl. That interjection was very Jedi-like. What can I say? You pick up a few things. I'm afraid Alan is not just making idle threats. He is rash and foolish enough to attempt a full assault on the Sandril estate. Such action would result in an all-out war between the families. I've seen men like Alan Matali before. He's so convinced that his hatred is justified, he's prepared to do anything. And if we don't intervene, there will be war. Until you find Shen, Jedi, we have nothing further to discuss. I suggest you hurry south to their estate, lest I take matters into my own hands. Okay, hint taken. We know where we're heading next, then. To the Sandrils! So I can't, I'm still kicking myself why I can't find this quest. I can't even find where it looks like it's supposed to be. Unless I'm going mad. 
If anyone knows which quest I'm talking about and where, how I'm missing it, please post in the comments. I might actually be able to go back and find it if um, it's, af it's before a certain point. <sighs> it's quite frustrating. And I have in every intention of being glowing with my right side. Let's talk to this droid over here. He looks less bristling than the last one. This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? Uh, I've come on behalf of the Jedi Council. The Council? If you are here because of Shen Matali's disappearance, you are wasting your time. The Sandals are not involved. This is nothing but a Matali witch hunt. I'm not in league with the Matalis, but I must speak to Nurek. Nurek left orders he was not to be disturbed, but given the circumstances, I will make an exception. Go into the main hall. Nurek will meet with you there. I have been informed by my protocol droid that you wish to speak to me. Uh, your son Cassius is dead. I've seen his body. Cassius is dead? I was afraid of this. Yet in my heart I knew it must be true. What, what happened to my son? He was killed by cath hounds. Um, while exploring the Dantooine ruins. Cath hounds? I was so certain the Matali family was to blame. But this changes nothing. My own son is dead. Why should I shed one tear about the disappearance of my bitter enemy's son? Typical. Anything to continue the feud which has become so customary to you people. I must ask you something, though it is difficult for me. My son had a diary, his private personal thoughts. Now that he is gone, I have nothing else to remember him by. Please, the diary means more to me than it ever could to you. I will give you a hundred credits for its return. Uh, he is the diary Nurek, but you keep your money. I need no reward for this task. I thank you for this. The diary is all I have left of my son. We have nothing further to discuss. Please, leave me to my grief. Ooh, who's this, I wonder? You are here from the council, are you not? Looking for Shen Metale? Um... I just came to tell you... Tell your... Your Nurek? Oh dear, hang on. I just came to tell your Nurek about... I think... About his son, Cassus. Cassus, shouldn't that be your father? Oh god. I, I hadn't noticed that at that rather dodgy, um... Bit of... T of, um... Mistyping before? My name is Rahasia. Nurik is my father. He has not been himself since Cassus disappeared. He is mad with grief, and he is convinced the Metales are responsible. He's not thinking rationally. Does this have anything to do with uh, what happened to Shen? My father is a good man. When my mother died, he raised me and my brother by himself. He loves his children, and we love him. I just don't want you to judge him too harshly. I only want to find Shen Matali. You must understand that Father has been under a terrible strain. I have no wish to disobey him, but there are matters where even my father's authority is not absolute. Please, tell me what happened. My father has kidnapped Shen Matale. He is holding him prisoner here in the compound. He feels this is a way to get back at the Matales, a way to get even for the disappearance of my brother Cassus. I see. Well, there is the answer we seek. The Jedi Council should be informed of this at once. You don't think that perhaps there's more to look at here, do you? That maybe everything isn't what it appears? Of course not. It seems very simple to me. The Council must be allowed to decide the next step. No. Since Cassus went missing, my father has become unstable. He might hurt him if you do that. 
He no longer even cares if the Matales are responsible for what happened to Cassus. I am afraid my father will simply kill Shen out of a mad, misguided lust for vengeance. Uh, I must tell the council at once. The Jedi Council does not have the authority to search our estate, and if Father finds out his secret has been revealed, he might kill Shen right away. Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I would take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Take this key. It will open an unguarded door at the rear of the estate. You and Shen can make your escape through there. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Please hurry. You are Shen's only hope. Why do you care about Shen? Shen and I, we... Well, we have been taught by our families to hate each other, just for being related to our fathers. But I met Shen alone one day in the city, away from his father. And, and Shen was so charming, so sweet. He didn't care at all that I was a Sandral. He just accepted me for who I was, with no reservations. We talked and met again over months and fell in love. My brother Cassus met him too, and they were beginning to become friends. But then this whole mess had to happen. Please find Shen and free him. You are my only hope. Hey, right side points. Also, yep. Has anyone? Can anyone else see the uh, um, Romeo and Juliet uh, quest line going here? Also, you have to excuse me because I can't remember what the different house names are of Romeo and Juliet. Ah! Seems she didn't think of giving us... Oh, wonderful. She didn't think about deactivating the droids before, she, before this. got here. Nothing in the north hallway. Oh, I'm gonna have computer spikes for that. Of course not. Anything I do have... Com oh, right. Anything I do have computer spikes for? Apart from killing myself? Uh, oh. Yes, I can do that. Uh, hey! Let's lower the um I haven't got the spikes anymore for anything else, but oh no, I think Oh, I should probably should have downloaded the schematics, but never mind. Uh oh, Well you ought to just get help the sodding way. Ah, there's some remains. And also I can level up, but I'll put another point in persuade, another point in repair. A master two weapon fighting. And then I'm going to have burst of speed. Powers, let's give her... Improved energy resistance, accept. I'm here. Oh, restricted by armor. Wonderful! On it. Damn!
Might have to have a think about the whole full speed thing. On it. Damn! On it. Damn! Maybe I should have put some more points in security! Oh. Note for self. 